Hey everyone, it's Miss Crystal from the Dickinson County Library and today is Friday so we have another fun flannel Friday. In honor of our tails and tails theme, I thought it would be really fun if we did the tortoise and the hare. And that's a fable and our story goes like this. Once there was a tortoise named Prudence and a hare named Flash. Prudence was very quiet and polite and whatever she did, she did very, very slowly. Flash, on the other hand, was very noisy and rude in everything he did. He did very, very quickly. Hare liked to tease Tortoise about being slow. When Tortoise ate breakfast, Hare would say, by the time you finish your last bite, it'll be time for dinner. Or if Tortoise was working in the garden, Hare would say, by the time you finish picking those spring flowers, it will be winter. One afternoon, Hare followed Tortoise to the store. Hare teased Tortoise on the way. By the time you get there, the store will be closed. You are so slow, I could beat you at, racing, at, at a race hopping backwards on one paw, Tortoise said. I could never beat you, Hare. Yes, you could, shouted Tortoise's friends. You just need a little help. Then will you race me, Tortoise? asked Hare. Tortoise was afraid, and he pulled his head into his shell. I don't want to, he said. You've got to, said his friends. You've put up with that mean, nasty Hare long enough. We think you can win. Tortoise didn't want to disappoint his friends, so he said, I'll do it. Tortoise had only two weeks to get ready, so he exercised and went jogging every day. Soon came the day of the race, and Tortoise was ready. Animals came from all over to watch the race and cheer on Tortoise. read the rules. The race will start when you hear the bell and the first to reach the finish line wins. Dog, oh. ready, get set, go. Dog, rain, the bell. Hare ran so fast he was out of sight before the tortoise had taken his first step. The animals cheered as tortoise slowly moved forward. Hare was so far ahead he decided he was going to stop and take a little nap. And while he was sleeping, tortoise caught up. When Hare woke up, Tortoise was two steps away from the finish line and the crowd was cheering, yay, Tortoise! Slow down, screamed Hare to Tortoise as he tried to catch up, but it was too late. Just as Tortoise was crossing the finish line, Hare was following after him. Tortoise smiled at his friends and his friends carried him on their shoulders. He had won the race. Tortoise had learned an important lesson that day. Work hard and believe in yourself and you can do almost anything. I hope you all enjoyed this version of Tortoise and the Hare and we will see you next time. Bye!